Okay, so here we are in my new workshop, and this is the curio corner cabinet that I'm going to be refinishing today. And um, as you can see, the shop is not done, and we have things like boat seats and lawnmowers, and oh, there's a bicycle, and additional things that we're going to use to finish the workshop. But I can paint in here, so it's all good. I'm going to show you real quick up close the piece that um, that I'm going to do what it looks like right now. So basically it is an old curio cabinet that was painted by someone already and I just went in with a sand block and removed any drips of paint that were on there and then I used a cloth to wipe off all the dust. I also used a paintbrush to get into the corners to make sure all the dust is out. Then I went in and used Bondo to do repair on, um, you can see the repair on the corner there. And also I repaired one of the doors that had a little chunk taken out, as you can see right there. And I sanded it flat, so um, that worked good. There's a few little chips in it that I'm gonna actually leave because I'm gonna distress it. So I'm not gonna concern myself too much with it. As you can see right here, there's a couple little chips and I think it'll fit good with the piece once it's done. I'm gonna put the doors back on also too I just kept the hardware I put it in this little Tupperware uh, they're wood knobs and some dark hinges I'm gonna put them back on and I'm gonna paint them as well and then distress them a little bit and what I'm using to do this today is Ann Sloan chalk paint in pure white I'm going to use the Anselone Soft Wax in a Clear to give it a nice finish. It's going to be a smooth, velvety finish. It's not going to be a high shine at all. Then I'm going to use, where I distress the piece, I'm going to use the Dark Soft Wax to give it that antique look. I also bought this paintbrush that uh, has really soft bristles on it. Um, I don't want to leave any streak marks on the piece when I'm painting it, so this should work very well. I am going to start the piece today. I'm going to paint it and then I will put up another video when it is painted and I'm doing the distressing. I'll talk to you soon.